So the purpose of this layer is just sort of an initial uh, sketch, really, to block in the shapes or to refine the shapes that have been um, already pencil sketched and penned over, um, just to start to establish darks and lights um, and to give a really good base for future layers to lay on top of, especially in the dark areas. It really helps give uh, the dark areas a lot more depth later on in the painting's life when the colors start to um, fade slightly and become more transparent. So that's basically what this is, is uh, a very rough sketch of darks and lights. And to start, this in this particular painting there is such a, there are so many dark areas that it won't really make sense until I add another layer to really darken in um, the dark areas. Like there's some detail in here that you can't really see because it needs to be even darker. Some detail inside the hair here around the neck um, that won't really start to show until the dark uh, background will be um, further refined. In fact, the background will be almost pure black, if not pure black. So you can also see for this painting, um, the palette is very simple. Here's the reference photograph that I have printed out in black and white just so I can focus on the shadows. Um, that's really all I care about at this moment is getting the shapes in the right place and um, developing the dark and light areas. You can see all I have used here is uh, burnt umber um, and it's just been diluted with turpen turpentine or actually turpenoid. Um, that's all you need. The lighter colors are diluted further and the darker colors are almost 
almost paint out of the tube, but the, uh, I don't ever use paint directly out of the tube because I use Kalinsky brushes, which need to, the paint to be thin somewhat. But um, that's all there is to it at this stage. You don't have to really worry about it looking perfect. Um, just get the darks and lights in the right spot and you'll further refine this again with another layer and then um, I'll also have um, the black and white Griselle painting that I'll do over this that will um, further refine the shapes and the darks and lights but it needs this foundation to sit on um, so uh, thanks for watching the video and um, stay tuned for further um, videos in this series and I'll give a little bit more detailed information during this series of videos than I've done in some of my other videos. I hope you have enjoyed watching and um, subscribe, uh, subscribe to the channel and come back and watch some more videos.